think back to uh, August 1992, 17 years ago, late August, when the Republican convention was being held in Houston in the heat. And um, one of the interviews that was on a videotape that we, a TV show that we produced at the time, was with Robert Novak, a syndicated columnist who died last week. The guy who was interviewing him is a fellow named Stoney Burke. Stoney is not your usual television interviewer, and uh, you'll either enjoy him or hate him, or a little bit of both. Um, at the time, actually, some of our funders hated him. But that's another story. This is a piece on the Republican National Convention, 1992, starting with a question about family values with Robert Novak, the late Robert Novak, and Stoney Burke, who I think is still alive, possibly living in his car. Nice to meet you. I'm Stoney Burke with the 90s. This family values thing, what is it a code word for? Well, I think it's a code word. It, it, I think people don't understand what family values are and going to uh, relate to it as an issue. Can't tell with somebody with uh, what family values are. Woody Allen is not family values. Not anymore? It never was, for crying out loud. But I mean, it's something that if you, if you really don't understand what they're talking about, uh, that, that person isn't going to get the issue. Really? I mean, it doesn't have to be explained. They should just get it. No. When family values are undermined, our country suffers. The values that, uh, of morality, the values of, of trustworthiness, of honesty, of, of, of uh, fear in God, support of country. All right, hey, here we are at the uh, pro-family God and country rally. It's a family affair. It's a family affair. It's a family affair. I'm here because I believe in this country and I believe in the values that are foundation of the country and the folks that uh, represent those values that are important to me are here today and I want to be with them. And what does this country mean to you? Well, this country is a tremendous land of opportunity, but it's also a country that has a great heritage. And part of that heritage is the, is the Judeo-Christian value and the one nation under God that has built us strong, so we're here to support that. Is it important that everybody believe in the same God? Yes, I think so. In general, yeah. Why is that? Um, world unity. It'll help us get along better. Improve world situations. Ladies and gentlemen, the Vice President of the United States. That was a wonderful rally today. I just wanted to tell you, it was so beautiful. Well, I was thrilled. We had over 3,000 people, and they were so enthusiastic. It was a great way to start celebrating this platform. Yeah, I wanted to ask you one more thing. Do you think the Native Americans had a soul, according to the pilgrims who came? <laughs> well, as far as I know, they did, but I don't know what the pilgrims thought. I certainly think so.